The electron transport chain is literally that last few steps of energy production in our cells. In the electron transport chain, we have to get electrons from one end of the factory as a raw material through each step of the way until we get to the last step, which is ultimately energy production. There are a few spots in the electron transport chain that are considered to be stationary. And then you have a few spots in the electron transport chain which are considered mobile. And the mobile carriers are responsible for picking up electrons from one complex and delivering it to the next. And it just repeats that cycle. So you're trying to get electrons down this chain and a few of these are stationary. You can't get electrons from one complex to the next magically. You need a delivery system to do that. So mobile carriers are just that. They go back to one complex and deliver, and all they do is repeat that. And as long as we can move electrons down that chain, we can get the electrons to the last step and ultimately create energy as a result. They have long names. We're not going to get into their long scientific names in this moment. So we'll just call them complex one, complex two, complex three, complex four, and ultimately two mobile carriers. One is called ubiquinol, and the other one is called cytochrome C.